Now it's the end of an era. Narayan Murthy has once again bid farewell to Enforces. He along with 11 other senior board members have stepped down, making way for the first outsider Vishal Sikka to take over the reins of the company. Now Deepa Balakrishnan has the details. He was one of India's most revolutionary entrepreneurs. And as N.R. Narayan Murthy got up to take charge of his last annual general meeting at Infosys, the hall was hushed with memories and expectations. Murthy, S. Gopala Krishnan and S.D. Shibulal are all stepping down from their executive roles at Infosys. This is the last time I'll be addressing you as the chairman of the company. I want the new CEO to chart his own path to create better glory for Infosys without any interference from the founders. Vishal Sikka will take over as the next CEO on August 1st and as one board member pointed out, has high ideals to live up to. Having seen it in the constancy in these beliefs, honesty, truth, hard work, simplicity, fact-led inferences and dedication, if I've seen this for 14 years, it's been there from before. And binding them all was their respect for a man who helped nurture the dreams of thousands of youngsters. The Infosys founders may be stepping down, but the Infosys story, of course, is one that will live on. The story of the rise from the 10,000 rupees company to the 50,000 crore rupee company is a legend that's bound to be told to students in colleges and to wannabe entrepreneurs over and over again in decades to come. In Bangalore, Deepa Balakrishnan.